Hey, what's up guys? Mule Skull here. Welcome back to Starbound. Episode 18, I think. Uh, when we left off, we finally got all of the high lotl scanning done. Uh, we talked to Esther. She said, let's go to the library. The Grand Pagoda Library and find the high lotl artifact. Um, I have to make some serious armor here. Where am I going? Right here. Um, I'm looking for the pioneer set. Is That's my goal. Um, I should make some silk if I can. I can't quite. Uh, we do have a moth trap, I think it is, at our farm. It's getting us some silk fiber from moths. Um, it's good. I love it. Um, it does it slowly, I think. I think I should make another one if I can, though. Um, what did I use for that? I think it was at home. Oops. Um, yeah. Let's go home real quick and see if we can get a couple more moth traps. I think it would be to our advantage to do that. It's at my home. Yeah, we upgraded this workbench. Um, we can we could do it with a wooden workbench, but but yeah. Oh man, he just keeps giving me money every time. Um, let's see, was it, I, I can't even remember which one it was, that's really dumb of me. It was probably up on the ship, something, I don't know. Hey, let's get your gift too. Come on. Oh, and the cook guy's got a quest. Should we do a quest for this guy? I don't think so. Um, they're kind of like side quests and don't really do much for us. Um, and we got this painting, oh, it's beautiful. Okay, let's go. Uh, if it's not here, we have to go somewhere else. That's for doors. Nah, I don't, I don't see it being there. Sorry, cook guy. Um, yeah, the first colonist had a quest. I'm like, dude, hey, I come around here once every, like, six months, and you're just gonna tell me to do things? No. How many should I make? Like, I think, oh man, what did I just use? All my timber. Okay, that's fine. I was like, uh-oh, <laughs> using all my Durasteel, or Tungsten. I'm not Durasteel yet. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. I'm going to kind of expand this a little bit this way. Um, and we're going to put some moth traps in here. Because I kind of want moths really bad. Really bad. I just want to have a place for silk. And I don't know why. I guess it's not a bad thing to want silk. It's, it's a goal in life, right? Here we go. I got three of them. Um, yes, moths. You can come here and drop off all of your goodies. That's what I want you to do. Okay? Do it, moths. Don't sass me. Um, I could make all this junk. Sure. No, I'm going to wait on it. Well, mm, my food situation is okay right now. Should stay fresh. I've got this spooky pie. Um, I keep having things rot because I just leave them in here instead of drinking them or eating them. <clears throat> um, that's kind of a hassle. But we do have some cotton. Let's pick that. I thought I had some over here too. I guess not. That's fine. It's raining. Why isn't this... I was going to say, wet that soil. Do it. At least we don't have to worry about food anymore. So much anyway. Because uh, we have tons of it. We could just... I think this should just be a rice farm and that's it. Um, I will pick the rice because it stacks. And is this... I think this is pearl peas. There's also cocoa pods and they stack too. Um, but whatever. Let's go. Oh, hey... Somebody's going to complain about this sooner or later. Um, I have to pick these carrots, okay? Don't judge me. I have to pick them because my kitty likes carrots. Kitty likes carrots, okay? Um, let's pick up the seeds first, though. And then let's place these seeds. And then... Um, should I get rid of something? I should get rid of something. 
The thorn fruit, am I ever going to use it? Maybe, one day. <laughs> but I have to take these carrots. I think, I think it's more important that I take the carrots than this rice right now. Even though the rice is like my best food source and I probably shouldn't be throwing it. I should be throwing these. Look at this corn cob. I'm not going to eat a corn cob. That's disgusting. Okay, good enough. I'm fine with that. Let's go cook some carrots for this cat. Because it's like the only food he eats. Like he hates everything else but carrots, which is a weird cat. Okay. Uh, I could make another one of these because I have a piece of wheat on me. Okay. Um, yeah, I don't know if he likes... Yeah, whatever. Whatever, cat. Oh, there's a dude up there. Hi, dude. Roasted carrots. Seven of them. See? And that's how we do it. And then we're gonna get out of here. Let's go... Ah, oh, did I even check the moss? That's kind of what I'm waiting for. Cat. Here. Have a carrot. Now watch him. You're not going to eat your carrot? I cooked that for you. Here, fine. Eat this carrot I threw across the room. And hearts. Okay, cool. You're awesome, cat. Um, uh, I'm tired of doing that stuff. I do have a little cotton on me. Well, I guess I have some silk too. Let's make a piece of silk. Um, let's make some cotton wool. So I've been kind of waiting on that too. And then, let's go to the anvil. And I can make a pioneer chest guard with our silk. Which is the step up. Takes a couple seconds. Canvas, how do I make that? Pioneer's chest guard. Um, I got the river breastplate. It's a high lotto thing. Bought it from a merchant, I believe. Um, this one's got 75, 30, 15, 15. This one's 75. It's the same thing. Why do I do that every time? Well, it looks better. I'm thinking the river one does, believe it or not. But we'll go Pioneer, because we're human. And then I'll put the booby bra over it again. I keep making the same damn armor, even though I don't need it. Ah, whatever. Doesn't matter. Um... Yeah, this is human, so... Safeguards a pioneer as they take their first steps into a new world. Um, what do we need for the second stuff? The pioneer trousers? Okay, let's check this real quick. 30, 12, 6, and 6. What do I have? Okay, 30, 12, 6, 6. Yeah, so... Yeah, we need the... Okay, so we need the pants. What do I have for a helmet? Uh, 15, 7.5, 3, and 3. Okay, this helmet is so much better. Uh, I need canvas for the helmet. And I need canvas for the pants. So two pieces of canvas. And that takes... Um, canvas. Oh, I can make two of them. Or no, I need... I need two more pieces of cotton wool, I think. Or cotton... Yeah, cotton wool. Okay. Um, yeah, let's make the head... The, the helmet first, because... The pants are closer in level than the helmet is, because my helmet is terrible, whatever it is. 15%. Yeah, this one's 45, so let's do that. Um, oh, it looks amazing with the booby bra, but I like the cat on my head. Okay, so now all we need is pants, and I think that would be cool just to complete a set finally. Let's go to the farm, see if we can get more uh, wool, cotton wool. Very quickly. Very quickly. Cool, we got silk. Fiber. Um, what am I doing? Cotton. Where be my cotton? Did I ever pick up seeds? Like, more cotton seeds? I don't think I did. Automato. Mushroom. Rotten food. Um, yeah. Cactus looks like another thing I should pick up more of. Because it stacks and it's, uh, yeah, it's good. So these four are like my main, I should just do these only for food, but 
Yeah, we'll worry about that another day. So I'm just missing pants. Do you think I can beat Dreadwing? Should I even try Dreadwing? I think I should. I gotta beat this guy someday. Um, and he's just being a real asshole about it. Uh, how many pixels do I have? I have 7,000 some odd pixels and I do not like that. Um, let's go get my other tech too. Let's take care of some things. There's a lot of like uh, little like things that you have to do to maintain your character to make sure they're up to par. Um, okay, so I don't want that. I want the body tech. Uh, a dash that can be used in in the air. Cool down 0.8 seconds. Um, or I could do multi jump, which is gives you three smaller jumps you can use in the air. Um, double jump works for me for now, but air dash would be nice. I'd like to be able to dash in the air. Because I find myself more and more... I can still dash on the ground. Okay, and now I can dash in the air. Yeah, I, it's kind of a struggle wanting to dodge but not having that. So that'll work. Uh, can I get a multi-jump or something? I think I still have some tech, don't I? I have six. Okay, so I can't get any more. I think everything's eight. Um, yeah, everything's eight. Okay. Now let's go fight Dreadwing. Let's just beam to the ship. We'll go talk to Sail and he'll send us there. I should be spending more money. But, whatever. We're okay. Dreadwing. Requires, uh, of the Beakeasy requires assistance. Okay, Ichiro? You're coming with me. Are you ready to go fight a really dumb penguin? Um, come over here. Okay, I just need you to get out of the way. Missions, Dreadwing, let's go. I'm gonna wreck him so bad. Oh, I'm gonna try. <laughs> it's kind of a pain. Let's go, Ichiro, come on. Oh man, we're rocking it already. Why aren't you getting in there? Kicking some butt. Oh, come on. Oh man, it does so much damage. Look at that. Yeah, who needs to get close? Oh, come on. I think I gotta summon it closer and then move it in. So that's pretty awesome that it does have its limits. And I think the cursor shows it. Let's see. Green means fully charged. Red means I can't cast it. So I can cast it right there. That's very cool. Alright. He's gonna be like, oh, so you've gotten stronger. And I'm like, yes. The power of my booby bra is what guides me. Like, you can't defeat me, Dreadwing. I have the power of booby bra. Yeah, we gotta take these guys out because they're a pain. Am I doing electric damage too? Is this... What the heck is this thing? Okay, it's only doing electric. Okay, that's good. Um, oh, hey, Dreadwing. How's it going? Oh, man. I also have this, buddy. Oh, and it's dead already. My, my Pokemon died. Okay. Um, yeah, let's be serious. Oh, I could poison Dreadwing, can't I? Um, yeah, this isn't going so bad now. So far. Okay.
I don't know if that did a ton of damage to him, but it did something, I guess. Let's see, what is the best strategy here? Probably this. Um, not that. I know I'm taking a ton of hits, but it's working so far, I think. Oh, man. Oh, really? I was just getting to my bandage. Oh, why, 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 why? Ah, it's so frustrating. I just lost a ton of pixels, too. 2,000 about. Just, I'm just taking the fourth number. Mm. Okay, punk, punk, punk. We're going in again. I'm, I don't even care how many friggin' pixels I lose. We're doing it. I'm doing it today. I'm tired of this bitch. <laughs> I know. I'm, I've been trying to kind of watch some of my language. I said something the other day I had to bleep. Um, it wasn't like particularly bad, but it was bad enough that it made me... I made myself bleep it. I was like, I didn't like it. <laughs> Um, yeah, it was some language that, you know, I mean, I, hey, I'm, I'm, I, I don't mind cussing personally, but I do know that there are kids watching and, you know, the, the occasional, like, F or S, you know, they don't bug me so much. Um, it's when I say other things that I, because I, hey, guys, I am not censored. Trust me. <laughs> um, but... There's some things I just don't like to say on YouTube. I put I ate the spooky pie because it gives me a damage boost. So hopefully that does okay for us. Um, yeah, and I just caught myself on fire because I'm awesome like that. I need to just keep up on Dreadwing. Uh, his little dudes don't really bug me so much. How much damage does this actually do to him? Oh, it does a decent amount, I guess. Oh man, that dive. so much freaking trouble with this guy F off <laughs> God That's a rocket Focus on Dreadwing Focus on Dreadwing I need, I need this. I need bandages bad. Dodge that. I'm out of bandages. Mm. 
Oh, these little bastards. Ah, come on. Come on. Live, Muley, live. Oh my gosh, no, not you. No, 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 no. Spikes. Shit, shit, shit. No. Oh, did I beat him? I think I beat him. I need to lay low for a second. Oh my god. Oh my god. Don't kill me. Need to fight. Need to fight. Oh, I did not enjoy that. <laughs> but I beat him, guys. God, it only took almost titanium armor. You. I'm going to kill all these penguins. Every one of them. I don't care what it takes. I'm going to just stab him in the face. Oh, man. So stressful. That was a fun fight, though. Dreadwing has come a long way. It used to just be kind of the boss you stand around and hit until it dies. See these guys over here camping? You're dead to me. And so are you. I'll just let you, uh... Yeah, you're the last one. Break all your stupid spikes. Oh, and I'm going to take a nap. Because that was crazy. Crazy, crazy fight. But we did it. I think it was worth getting that out of the way. Because now the beakeasy is open. I don't know what it does. Um, I should probably track this quest since we're doing it. Dreadwing the penguin. Track it. Return to the bartender at the outpost. Cool. And I'm fully healed and ready to go. Sweet. Sweet, sweet. Oh, we got a codex, too. Um, Dreadwing the Penguin Codex. Gather ye round and hear tell of Dreadwing's scourge of the universe. Bane of all spacefarers, seldom a day goes by without some new nefarious scheme occurring to this contemptible beast. I think I read all that right. Uh, he prowls the stars in his flying saucer, leaving naught but bitter resentment in his wake. Followers flock to him, drawn by respect or compelled by fear. At the sound of his name, his enemies scatter to the four winds. He is Dreadwing, the small blue penguin. Yay, Dreadwing's dead. I killed him forever. Never, ever, ever fighting him again. Unless he gets a rare drop or something later on. But that's later on. We made it. Let's go talk to this guy. Got a ship? I don't want to talk to penguins right now, dude. What is this? Okay. Lawless, godless, fightless. That's me. Or flightless. <laughs> I've got an itchy trigger flipper. Adventure excitement doubloons. Oh my gosh, these guys are awesome. Uh, you sorted him out for me. Thanks. Oh, you sorted him out for me? There's a question mark there. Uh, thanks. Now I'm back in business. Come speak to me if you want a doubloon to hire a penguin merc. A doubloon? Oh, what does this do? A contractual token accepted by penguin mercenaries at the Big Easy Bar. Cool. Cool. Um, yeah. Right on, guys. Oh, man. Can I sit at the... Oh, I can sit at the bar. Oh, my gosh. I need this. I need to scan it. Give me. Okay. Cool. We made it. Oh, no. No. No, 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 no. Get out of here. I don't want... I don't want penguins chasing me. I'm sick of you guys. All right. We did it. Hooray. Um, There is a reward bag. And it gives me a tech card. Oh, baby, I'm at seven. All right. Um, I think I got some cotton at home yet? Or at the farm? We got to check. We got to check because it's kind of what we're waiting on is getting the last piece of titanium armor. Then we'll be good. Oh, look at that. Excellent. Um, What do I have? Pioneer. Combat medic. Pioneer. Oh, I just need the pants. Okay, 
So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to finish this set. Um, anything else? Not that I can think of. I'm going to put a torch right here for no reason. Let's go. Man, oh man. Ichiro, you were a lot of help. Um, I need to make this canvas, don't I? So I need cotton wool. Then I can make a canvas. Canvas. And then, pants, right? I need to confirm. Combat medic trousers. Pioneer, pioneer. Okay, pants. Pants it is. These ones look better anyway. The new ones. Pioneer's trousers. Forge. Oh, and I think they are better. I think I said that before. Um, 20, 30. Yep, cool. Where are they? Right there. Pioneer's trousers. How do I look? Oh, I look pretty good. I like it. It's pretty generic, though. Um, I do like the cat butt thing. I could, I could stand to lose the booby bra um, for a bit, because I've kind of had that on for <laughs> a couple episodes. Uh, and the predatory trousers, I don't... Yeah. Cool. In you go. And in you go. And this helmet. I kind of I kind of dig the helmet, but it's generic as hell. Um, do I have any other vanity I want to wear? I don't think so. I just like the cat butt head for some stupid reason. Could be the evil mushroom guy, but... Yeah, I think we look fine. Um, yes, 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 we're good. So this thing, I don't know, was it this guy? No, it was the other one. Um, our unknown indescribable horror went down, which is kind of a bummer. Uh, we'll need to look into getting something called a, is it a pet medical station or something like that? Um, yeah. Could do this right now. Probably should, huh? Let's do it. I think uh, it works with your air too, but we did just lose our light to augment. That's fine. Snow in the trash. All right. Um, should we go check out the pagoda library yet? Um, I feel like I'm ready. Dreadwing was a special case, I think. Meh. Meh. We could stand to lose the wings for a bit, huh? I think I'm going to carry around the lantern on a stick. No. Do I have another back wear? I don't think I do. Spacesuit backpack, no. Okay, yeah, why not? We'll carry around the lantern on a stick. Um, but I think I'm going to call it an episode, my friends. Uh, next episode, we're going to do the Grand Pagoda Library. Um, which I've never done should be interesting because there hasn't been a high, there hasn't been high level villages ever when I've played so this should be different I think I'm gonna enjoy it uh, if it's anything like the rest of the game then yes I will enjoy it <laughs> there you go Kite. oh I locked him in here and made him just stare at his food there you go get some food bud it's up there get it Kite. oh he's like I'm just gonna take a nap thanks for the food Muley um can I make a better weapon? Two or twenty? No, this is. I think it's better. Well, no, it's actually that's better. It's faster, and it's got blade roll, and it's got more attack, but only barely than my common my common spear. Should I make just make the titanium spear, huh? I should. Yep, it's better. Let's do it. Titanium spear. I have a generic melee weapon. Actually, you know what? I don't. I have this. Oh wait, it's not a fire sword. Okay, yeah, that's fine. I'm gonna go back to sword for a bit. Yeah. Alright, my friends, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed this episode, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!